Okay, just been out for a quick spin on the bike this morning. Put that 11.32 on the, on the back, the SRAM, 11.32 10 speed. Put it on the bike uh, yesterday. Um, just went out for a quick run today, it was only about 45 k's. Um, no major elevation, only about 300 meters all up, 267, something like that. So nothing major, but I did put it into the 32 just to try it and it all ran fine. Um, no problems at all, no grinding, no funny business going on, um, seemed to work just fine. Um, my mate that I was out with was amazed that I actually got a 32 on there, he couldn't believe it. Um, so look, it works, um, I'll keep you updated as to whether or not it does any, does any long term damage. At the minute I can't see it because when I'm riding the bike or you know, and you, and you put it into the 32, there's no grinding, there's no funny noises. There's nothing really. The only thing I would say is you wouldn't run, which I would never do anyway, you wouldn't run the 50 uh, big ring at the front with the 32 on the back because the chain is well and truly at an angle. So you wouldn't do that, which I mean, I never run the 50 and the 28 like that anyway. Um, so if you're going to be in the 28, you may as well drop it down into your 34 and come down a few um, pegs rather than be have your chain at an angle. So. I never did that anyway, so that isn't going to be an issue for me. But I think when mechanics and different people are online saying, um, look, you can't do this because it will tear up your um, derailleur, it will do this, that and the other, I think they're thinking when it's in the 50 and the 32, because the chain is at a serious angle there, and you, it definitely does grind and crank and creak away. Um, but the main thing is you just don't ever go into that gear which there's absolutely no need for you ever to be in that sort of gear in um, you would only use the 32 when you're in the 34 at the front so all I can say at the minute is for me on my bike um, Ultegra DI2 short cage um, and the SRAM 10, 10 speed um, 11.32 fits just fine so I shall find some bigger hills this weekend and um, I'll give it a go then and I will do another video and see how we go. Hopefully by then <coughs> I'll have my Garmin Verb back. It's in being repaired at the minute. Um, something went wrong with it, I don't know what, but hopefully I'll have that back and I'll be able to do a video on that going up a hill and I'll put all the stats on with the power and the cadence and all the rest of it. So hopefully we'll have it back by then. Other than that, I hope it's been of some help to you. See you on the next one.